Hello, once again, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to backup and restore backup on your WhatsApp chat. So this is my WhatsApp chat and then I want to just perform some backup and then show you how to restore this in a moment. So click on the three dots at the far right corner and then go to settings. So from settings, go to charts. Under chart, we have team wallpaper chart and chart history so click on that and then from here scroll down and then go to chart backup so what you want to do is they want to indicate where we want to actually do our backup so we want to do this into our email so we have the google account you need to set it up if you don't have just click on add account and then just add your gmail if you don't have or if you already have just select that from the list in my case I'm going to use one of these for my backup and basically have to confirm that so let's allow this whatsapp to have access to our gmail so click on allow so this is done as you can see i've just changed my email so backup to google drive you have to indicate when you want to do your backup you can do it daily weekly monthly and only when i tap on backup so any of this should work I'm going to select monthly so it depends on how often you want to do your backup just select that like subscribe for more you can also backup using your cellular that's using your phone data by default it's likely going to use your wi-fi so if you don't have wi-fi you can switch to what cellular that's your phone data if you want to include videos in your backup then you can easily do that as well i don't want to include video because it's going to take some time i'll turn this off and now that i have everything set up where i want to direct my backups to i can easily click on what backup so that is what i'm doing you can see it's going to back up my messages it's likely going to take some time to do that and when this is done i'm actually going to re remove my whatsapp i'm going to remove my whatsapp and I show you how to restore this backup so we're going to wait for this to finish we're going to wait for this to finish and then we'll look at how we can restore our backup back so i'll get back to you once this is done so as you can see our backup is successful and the size is around 269 megabytes and the time that we did this is being indicated over there so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to remove my WhatsApp and assume you install this on a different PC, we'll see how we can restore this back. So let's jump into action and see how to do that. So I'm going to remove this and then during the installation process, I will show you how we can restore this. Okay. So I downloaded WhatsApp again. Let's see how we can restore our charts back. So let me open this. And then I'm going to select my preferred language. Then I'll, I'll accept to the terms and agreement. And I'm actually going to enter the number I want to use for. So I'll enter the number I'm going to use this way and click on next. So I'm actually going to verify this with my pen. It's my secret. So verification complete i'm going to click on continue and then allow whatsapp to access some part of my profile so it's also going to look for backups so you see what is happening I'm looking for backup so i'm just going to allow this some time so this is our backup our backup has been detected as the 269 and i've done this backup 24 minutes ago and this is the email that we used so because we want to restore this we just have to click on restore and then you can see the process is going to take some time depend on the speed of your internet so we just have to allow ourselves some time for this process to complete so there we go our chart is 
almost done restoring messages so this will be done pretty soon and then about 6108 messages restored click on next and then my proof and everything is there already i'll click on next and then just give yourself some time for this to initialize so this is going to initialize in a moment so whatsapp is going to open in a moment so we just have to allow ourselves some time so as you can see our charts are definitely back just before we did this backup and uninstall whatsapp we got everything back and we're still restoring the media and it's going to take some time but if i scroll you can see my charts before i even remove this whatsapp i still have them back so this is how to back up and then restore your charts on whatsapp like subscribe for more tips and tricks till i come away again bye bye